Hello, everybody. I'm going to show you guys how to make Valentine Love Bug with just a few supplies. It won't cost you very much money. Super cheap to put together. I'm Miss Anita. This is Miss Anita's Crafts. So, um, I'm going to show you right now. Like, you just saw the picture that shows you what your supplies are. So, I'm going to show it to you again. Okay, so now we're going to use those things and we're going to make our bug. So, we start with our naked paper towel. Toilet paper too. <laughs> it's the tiniest roll of paper towels ever. No, it's toilet paper. <clears throat> so, I mean, we all use toilet paper. You know, just admit it. So, we're going to cover this toilet paper tube with glue. And I'm just using Elmer's glue because it's nice and thin and super runny. And it spreads really well. And use a paintbrush. Don't try to squirt it on for crying out loud. Um, you waste so much glue and it comes out really uneven. So when you brush it on, it does not come out uneven and you can get the whole thing covered. So, piece of paper. That is that six by four inch piece of paper that I showed you earlier in the instructions. We're going to wrap it around the toilet paper tube. Thusly. Thusly. That's a word you don't hear enough. It's a very good word. Um, I'm going to add a little more glue right here to seal it. Check that out. Get in on, on crafting, it's a lot of fun. So now we have the pink toilet paper too. So nice. Um, these are for my wings. So what I'm gonna do with these are um, peel and stick foamy hearts. I'm just gonna peel it back a little, okay? And I'm do that with both of them. I'm just gonna peel the point back and leave the top of the heart um, covered. So we pick up our pink toilet paper tube and we stick them on on either side. Can you guys see that? I'm the worst cameraman. I'm crafter, I'm not a cameraman. Not even a man. Anyway, or a camera woman, a camera person. Anyway, <laughs> so I have um, my wings on. And they're not tacky in the back because the paper's still attached, which is very convenient. So I won't stick to your hair. I always get things stuck in my hair. I got a lot of hair. Okay, let's get this over with, right? You're like, lady, shush, come on, show me how to make this. I'm going to glue on his eyeballs with a little bit of Elmer's glue. And these are just your. Plain old, everyday, ordinary, googly eyes that you find, you know, maybe in your kitchen on your bananas. Am I the only one that does that? Okay. Anyway, so he has wings and he has eyes. So cute. Um, what else does he need? He needs a nose because right now, how does he smell? Awful. <laughs> a tiny little purple pom-pom. I was just going to dip that straight in the glue. Don't mess with trying to brush it on because you're going to fail miserably, I promise. Now he has a cute face. The faces are cuter the more you smush things up. So the more like the eyes and the nose are close to, oh look, they're a little friend, close to each other, um, the cuter the face. Just, you know, if you're looking at it and it's not that cute, it's probably because your nose is too far from your eyes. I don't think it's the same with people. I mean, I wouldn't want my nose to be here. I don't think I'd look cute. There's actually a Snapchat filter like that and it's not a look, good look for me. Um, the other two pom-poms, are um, for buttons, clearly. So he's gonna stand right here and look at you guys <laughs> while I show you what we do with these two little strips that you saw in the instruction page. You take them and you wrap them around a paintbrush stem or like a, a pen or a pencil, whatever. But I'm gonna do the paintbrush stem and you just kind of curl it. Can you see how I'm curling it around? I don't know if that translates. But then when you undo it, you unfurl it, you have um, an antenna. So I just drag that through the glue and stick one on one side. And since it's paper, like it sticks fairly quickly, so you don't have to worry about dry time. Oh, sorry, we had an incident. You don't have to worry about dry time. Um, it dries pretty quickly. Now I'm gonna cut out another antenna because I think my hair brushed the one that I had pre-cut away, so easy enough to fix, right? Um, so we're gonna curl. This is a great gift for your kids to make for Valentine's Day to give to all their friends. Like, you know, take your toilet paper and just unravel it right now so you can get to the really important part, which is the cardboard core. <laughs> and I'm dipping that. I don't do that. I do, this. I do that sometimes when I run out of these guys. Save these toilet paper tubes and use them for crafts or bring them to me, for crying out loud. Um, okay, and he totally lost his buttons. That's because Elmer's glue takes a little while to dry, but we're gonna put his buttons right back on. And, you know, embellish it some more if you want to add some heart stickers or whatever, but there he is. Uh, 
just a day ago, he was propped up in the bathroom being used as toilet paper holder. And now he's a love bug and he's adorable and he's bringing everyone much joy. And he has his little friend. Um, so that's it. Make one today. You won't be sorry. This is our preschool project today. And I have these preschool projects every week on Mondays and Wednesdays from 11 to 1. Very similar to this. And I'll try to put a tutorial on in case you missed the class and you want to make it at home. But it, let me tell you, it's a lot more fun to make it with me. I'm, I'm a hoot. I think so. And with lollipops. All right. So thank you for watching and make yourself a love bug. Bye.